Well, grab the bratwurst and fajitas and pack up the pickup truck. It's tailgating season. There's nothing like rooting for your favorite football team. That's Today we're rooting dance. for the Notre Dame people, I guess, because that's our producer's, you know, alma mater. Cyber Bob is here with great finds for the ultimate tailgater. I imagine you as like tailgate guru. Is it true? I'm all about tailgating. I had a feeling. I, I, had a feeling <laughs> I don't you know if you knew that or not, but I am all about <laughs> tailgating. And uh, there's a great website, the American Tailgater, and this is like a little, uh, what do you call it, a little, little brochure book they have there. there. A there brochure. are many Christmas presents that can be found in the American Tailgater. So we went through here and had them send us some of their best products. Okay. And we're going we're gonna to look at some of them right now. Now the first one, now don't you hate when you're out tailgating yep. and you want to have some margaritas, and but you can't plug in your blender. Where do you plug that thing in, Cyber? So I want to show you how you would do it, okay. all right? Now the key to margaritas is precise measurement. Right. Okay, so you put in some ones. Sure. I think um, three. That's good, I think that's good. Three I'm handfuls, scared. three handfuls, okay. And sure. then you pour in it, the specified amount. Right, and we're just using the mix today. That, because I think you need a little more. So, yeah, Because we don't have any tequila. So mix Well, we put up. the tequila on after. after. <laughs> For the show. Jose Cuervo. <laughs> All right. So, so uh, where do you plug this thing in or what? Well, <laughs> you don't need to plug it in. Because, oh, that's the catch of it. Because this thing is gas powered. Are you ready? Oh we'll just my. turn this bad boy. <laughs> <laughs> it's got a little throttle on it. That off. Wow, but and will it mow your lawn? <laughs> well, it also doubles as a weed eater if you need <laughs> it later. That is awesome. So you don't that's, plug it in. That, I do like the throttle. I mean, that is important to have it's, on a it's blender. It's really an essential element of any tailgating party, I think, nowadays, if you're going to be in, in today's world. Okay, what's our next little trick here? Don't you hate <laughs> when you go and buy some beer? Yeah, fruit beer. And uh, you did, they didn't have the kind you want cold. Right. All right, so you get home, you don't want to drink a warm beer. Right. You want to uh, drink a cold one. What's this little This is called the Cooper Cooler. The Cooper Cooler. The Cooper Cooler, right. it, in, in one minute, it'll make a can of beer right. cold or um, a bottle. It'll take three minutes. Or if, if you drink wine, I, I don't know, people drink wine. Right. And um, It can do wine. It'll do wine too. So what you do is you put, put it in there. Okay. You select if it's a wine or a can or whatever. Uh-huh. Select your setting there until the start. And the thing is you can have it open too when you're doing it. Look at that. It's just sort of cooling it with cold ice water. In one minute, this will be this will be cold. Now the thing is, the question <laughs> around the studio today is, now when I open it, is it going to explode? That well, is a good question. Well, I haven't actually tested that yet. So well, what we're going to do? We're going to test it live on air. We're going to test it. We're going to give it a couple minutes to do its. Right. Well, actually, it's only supposed to take a minute. So we'll let okay. it do its thing right here. Okay. And when it's done, we're going to check it out and see if it's cold and see if it's too fizzulated or All whatever. All right, close All right. it up. Let it cool off. Cool. Thing. Meanwhile, right. well, that's, uh, <laughs> I'm afraid it's going to be very dangerous when we open it. But tell me about this. What's this little item? This is your all-purpose uh, um, cooler right here. It's got, it's got everything. It's got the Ooh, look at this. Little, little koozies built into it for, for your look at that. beer. Okay. And, uh, but the coolest thing about this is it's got speakers built right into it. Can you see those right here? Yeah. All right, so it's got a radio built into it, so you can listen to the radio. Or if you've got, like, a Walkman or a Discman or whatever, you can hook that up to it. Oh, wow. And you're off and going. And it folds down into nothing. It's got like 17 different configurations. It's Very got cool. pockets all over the place. Oh. It's done, it's done. folks. <laughs> all right, so okay, what so we're going to do. But let me see if it's cold. Let me feel, feel it. it. Feel it. Ooh, chilly. Okay, I open it. it. No, you open Go it. Go ahead and open it. No, I'm not opening it. You open it. Are you ready? <laughs> Wait, open <laughs> it over there. Cool. Okay. Let's see if it Let's actually. <gasps> <gasps> wow. No. All right, yes. taste it. See if it's cold. Okay. It's root beer, folks, just so you know. Root beer. It's got a little kick on it, huh? <laughs> that was not a burp you heard. It it's, was not. <laughs> it's very cold. It actually is. It is. It is cold. It's like came out of the fridge, yeah. right? Yeah. Wow. Perfect. All right. Christmas present. Okay. One more thing. What we've else done? we got here? Th these are inflatable speakers. Because you know, you're always looking to conserve room. Right? right. So you can take these. They actually turn into pretty nice speakers. Just put some air in them. Hook them up to your Walkman or whatever. Bang. You got music. Boom. Do they sound good, Cyber? Okay. <laughs> okay. We've got a couple other things to talk about, and we've got pictures. Are these from the uh, American Tailgater? Everything today Everything? is from the American Tailgater. Very good. We're just loving it. It's the it's uh, the personal beverage vendor. Okay. Because you know you need your own beverage vendor at home. You should. Everyone should and, have one. And you can have it branded. So if you're Karina, you'd have Notre Dame on there. Right. If you're a sane person, you put Ohio State University on there. It, it depends whatever uh, school you want or or team. Right. This is an important thing to me. 
if you're camping or mm -hmm. whatever, you need your coffee. Oh, yes, you do. And Who wants I don't to know percolate if you ever tried that thing over a campfire? Ever tried, yeah, it, it just isn't the same. <laughs> no, it's not. You just plug your little coffee maker up into your lighter there, hey, and you're, hey, hey. you're going. Now, here's something pretty cool. It's, it's called the beer keg grill. Mm -hmm. So, um, beer keg. Sure. Split in half. As grill. Got a grill. And Look you at can that. put your team on it or whatever, too. That's kind of cool. And this is, you know, bug zapping can be a pain. Right. So why not make a game out of it? So here you got a little, a little <laughs> bug zapper. It's like a fly swatter, but only it electrocutes the little devil. So every time you hit them, all Ooh. right. So <laughs> what family not fun? Not only do you get to kill bugs, you get to electrocute them at the same time and turn it into a game. So you, you can, can collect the most. You can enjoy the bug game after Send the kids out there so you can collect the most. Margaritas yeah. from your. Uh... Don't give margaritas to the kids. All right. This is something you need to learn. You're oh, pregnant Sandra. now. You need to know this. I love this. This is all <laughs> great information. And this is good. It's right before Christmas. You can find a whole bunch more things in Give the American Tailgater Company catalog. Phone number's up there for you. one 888 4263 AmericanTailgater.com. Husbands are so happy. I know. <laughs> Cyber Bob, if you have questions or, you, you know, you just got to ask him about that blender, you can email him CyberBob at WOAI. Got to finish this up here. All right, Jay. <laughs> up next on San Antonio Living, a recipe from the Medina Lake Cajun Festival. It's red pudding.